ready. Who's ready? This is Bonesaw here, and welcome to my fourth progress video. So this uh, clip was before the Power Cape, uh, as me preparing for it. But the reason why I didn't upload it was because I would rather surprise you guys with the video instead of, you know, saying I'm gonna do it and fail. So basically, this took about two or three days total, and it was a lot of no lifing. It was really hard to get 60 range, harder than I thought, because by then people had 70 and 80 range. But the only reason they didn't have a Power Cape was because of their bottleneck, because they didn't have sweets and they didn't have brews. So I did what no one else was doing, was buying purple sweets in Varrock. There was nobody selling them, which is really annoying. It took about, I think, 15 hours total to get all the sweets. And uh, I messaged the number one ranked Herblore in the game. His name was Mithril. He had 76 Herblore ranked, but uh, he didn't log out. And nobody else knew that. So I was the first person to buy Cerebrus off him for Fire Cape. The other person that was going for Fire Cape started at wave 30. He failed eventually. But uh, you know, I realized, hey, this is the only chance I can get fire cape to be the first the fire cape as a whole was pretty simple with 60 range the hard part is that it just takes a long time to kill everything uh because i had defense it was relatively easy to tank the 90s so what i had to watch out for was just simply conserving my uh prayer potions and i got to wave 56 and i realized i had three prayer potions i got to wave 56 and i realized i had three prayer potions if you have ever done a fight cape before you realize that if you have three potions at 56 there's something terribly wrong you're going to fail no matter what unless you do something different. So that's when I decided to do what I've never done before in any fire cape was to pray for the 360s. So, you know, other people were saying that even even if you do that, you have to get the Jad with one prayer potion left, you know, three, three, three doses of them. So <laughs> that's when that's when things got real. And, you know, a friend was just uh, you know, messaging me on Skype. Hey, Nate, you know, you have 7K viewers on on Twitch, right? I was like, that's impossible. Uh, it's never been that high before on live stream. So I check it. I'm like, oh shit, there is 7k people watching me. So if I fail, 7,000 people will watch me fail. So I decided to, you know, take a little breather and uh, get some crowd support right here. And it was intense because that's about one fourth of the people playing RS that's just watching me play. Apparently, there are people in every world spamming that I uh, was doing it. So, you know, while one quarter of the RuneScape population is watching and also spending my entire bank getting the supplies. And also having one attempt to do this because, you know, there's someone else going for it at the same time. Why would it be nervous? So the Jad fight was around 10 minutes total. I got the healer's trap behind him and I kept hitting zeros though near the end uh, when I only had, you know, two prayer point, one prayer point left. And I had, you know, twitch in the corner of my eye. So I was watching people freak out. I was freaking out a little bit, just a little bit. <laughs> and I killed him with one prayer potion left. But the best part is the prayer went to zero as soon as I killed him. So I, I actually can't think of a greater, more intense moment I've ever had on RS. I sat there on my chair just for three minutes, just like staring at the screen. I didn't even know what happened. Realizing, hey, this is the reason why we play 2007 RuneScape. I could quit right now and be happy. It's not about the 99s, it's about just having fun, doing stuff like this. But uh, I want to thank Grosscore and Bodhi for giving me uh, the support when I needed it. Oh, the spot he is in. He has aggro on him, but they're not a Oh god, he's gonna do it. I think he's gonna get it. Oh shit! This is good! This is good! This is clutch! He just needs to ho hope that his prayer don't run out! He needs to hope that his prayer don't run out! He needs to pr pray switch! Pray switch! I'm actually shaking. I'm actually shaking. <gasps> Red board! No way. One HP. One prayer point. Do not mess up. Oh my god. Eight. Come on, 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 come Oh my fucking god! That was actually the most legendary clip. I think that's actually the most legendary thing I've ever seen on RuneScape. I don't even know what could possibly top that. So after that, I went for a run. Uh, kind of chilled out for the rest of the night. The next day, I went for Monkey Madness. Uh, it was pretty easy with prayer. There was no prayer flicking involved here. <laughs> 
as you can see, I have enough prayer potions. I, uh, I'm probably going to go for a fire cape on my pure sometime soon. I'm not sure if I'm going to go for higher than 31 prayer. Oh yeah, I haven't talked about my pure yet. So I've been training up uh, my pure, Bone Sauce, the Space PK. So I'm going to get that to join foe and, uh, you know, go to some trips. It's a pure clan if you do not know what it is. So that's up in the works. I'm not entirely sure what kind of pure I want yet. So if you have any ideas for me, suggest it in the bottom. See what kind of pure you want me to make. I'm thinking about just 40 attack for now and then getting uh, higher as I get the money. Uh, I did Fremnik quest for the Berserker Helm. Going for the max strength bonus. I want to get the max strength bonus as soon as possible. I'm not sure about the barrel gloves. It's going to take about a week to two weeks to get. Uh, I work 40 hours a week, so I don't have the most time to play RuneScape. But uh, it's becoming really fun for me, uh, and uh, I really enjoy putting out videos. And you guys have to remind me to put out daily videos, because uh, you know I, it's not my job. I I do it for fun, so I really have to like make myself force myself to do it, or else it just won't happen. It's been a long process, uh, and a lot of things I wanted to you know kind of get out of the way before I do some Slayer. And the Fire Cape is definitely gonna be awesome to slay with as well but one more thing is that it does protect under uh rune as well if you have full rune and d skim and fire cape it does protect over a fire cape so make sure that if you do get one you know you know what protects over it and you don't you know lose your fire cape oh yeah and last thing make sure you go to bonesaw bamf's clan chat if you want to come chill with me um there most of the time and also add Bonesaw Banff in game because whenever I stream on Twitch, I will be flicking it, my private on for like five seconds to let you know I'm streaming. But anyways, that's my max strength for now. I'm going to go for Barrel Gloves and Torso when Barbarian Assault comes out next week. And Berserker Ring, I'm going to do Dagonoths myself to get the Berserker Ring. So make sure you subscribe if you want to be you know notified as soon as possible. And uh, I'll see you guys later.